What is going on guys, this is Mixkeelis here with another CSGO video and today I'm going to be doing the top 5 best knife unboxings from the Gamma case so far. And we've already had a lot of really nice knives unboxed and I've gone through all the YouTube videos and just any VODs I could find and I've tried to select the top 5 most expensive ones based on how much these knives could actually sell for. I don't know the exact prices on all these but I'm pretty sure I've got it figured out and I put together a nice little top five for you guys because you guys seem to really like it when I make a little like community unboxing video because all my community unboxing videos have got like a million views so hopefully you guys will enjoy this video and let's get right into the first one. So this first unboxing is from a YouTube channel called Ultimate and I'll have all the links in the description to the people that unbox these knives but they unboxed a really nice knife from a Gamma case and I'm actually going to talk about what knife they unboxed and the value and stuff about it after they unbox it. I'm not going to spoil what it is before they get it because I thought that was a little stupid how I did that in my other videos, but you guys will see what they get and let's get into it. So these guys unboxed an M9 Lore field tested. So this is actually selling for over $600 right now on like OP skins. And theirs was unboxed on I believe the very first day after the cases came out. So it was probably worth even more right then. And probably the one of the absolute first knives unboxed from the Gamma cases. And the Lore knives are being sold for quite a lot. Definitely going to be one of the more expensive patterns. So that is the number 5 ranking of my top 5 case unboxing videos. So now moving on to number 4, we've got Oki with a pretty sick unbox, and here's what happened. Shouldn't believe, mate. Believe in spags for you. Oh no. It annoys me you guys being so far behind. So he got the Crambit lore, and I'm not entirely sure what condition it is, but I believe it's either minimal wear or factory new, because I've looked at some similar ones, and the minimal wear ones are selling for like over $800, and factory new is selling for over $1,500, I believe, and obviously all the, all the items in this video are going to be going down in price, but they're worth an absolute fortune at the moment, which makes it even more crazy to get these items unboxed. But let's get into the next unboxing, which is by T. Martin. And I know if I didn't include this one, all the comments would just be spam with you forgot T. Martin's video because people really wanted me to put his knife in the other video I made. But either way, his unboxing actually was definitely one of the best ones caught on video. And let's get into it. So far, we haven't had the best luck, but uh, I'm, I'm putting in every effort we possibly can here. We're going to see... Uh... We're gonna see if it led me in the right direction. We just saw the M4A1S Mecha Industries go by. in the morning. I'm, oh my god, that's so crazy. 
It's stat track, bro. Stat track bayonet gamma. <laughs> I can't even speak. What's the wear on it? What's the wear? Show me, show me the wear. Factory new. Stat track factory new bayonet gamma doppler. Let's fucking go, boys. Oh my god. There was something deep down inside. I bought additional cases. I always. So he unboxed a stat track phase 4 bayonet gamma doppler, which is pretty insane. Of course that phase has got the lime green and the blue on it, so really cool looking. And I'm not entirely sure on the value though, because the ones that people are buying for the most right now are the emeralds and these knives. The prices are just drop dropping every single day, so I'm not even going to try to give a price estimation on this, but I'm sure he sold it for a lot, or he might just keep it because it is a pretty cool knife. And uh, he did unbox it himself, pretty cool, but let's get into the next unboxing, which is by my friend Jehovah. We've actually got a lot of bigger streamers and YouTubers for this video, but either way, Jehovah definitely unboxed one of the coolest gamma knives so far, so here is his unboxing. Buddy. Oh God. God bless you, thank you. Something good. You know, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, Oh, Oh my god, dude. That message read, if you didn't hear, in honor of tonight's cases, I'm blue, da ba di da ba da ba da ba da He was making fun of the fact that we were getting nothing but blues, and we got a fucking knife! And it's a Gamma Doppler Karambit. Oh. 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 What where? It's not an emerald. It's not an emerald. It's not an emerald. Factory now! Woo! What is that phase? Phase, uh, I don't know. It's one of the, it's not, a, it's not an emerald, unfortunately. So his knife is a phase two, which is probably the second best phase at this point, besides emerald. They seem to be selling for the most out of the other phases. They're kind of like the fake emerald phase, which uh, I don't really like that term too much. Because it really isn't the same thing, it does have the black going through it, but it is, it's very green, and the play side is almost completely green. Just kind of has like the black highlight going through the whole thing, so it's not really the same thing, but it is a pretty cool knife. And the only one I could find right now of this is selling for like $2,000 on OP skins, and all the other phases seem to be selling for cheaper. So this uh, phase is probably the best one, and is probably the second most valuable item a box from this video. I don't think it's worth two thousand dollars, but I I think it could probably sell for over a thousand at the time being. So for the number one spot, we've got Tia Gavsky. I don't exactly know how to pronounce his name. This guy's pretty cool. I believe he watches some of my videos. I think one of his friends was on my Vact Band inventory series, which isn't really the best thing. But either way, let's get into his unboxing, which has the number one spot. Star Trek! Oh man, you think you're there, man? What the fuck? What the fuck? What the fuck? Knife! What the fuck? What the fuck? Mas esta merda é toda verdinha, Esmeralda Star Trek! What the fuck? Olha para aqui. E todos me abertores de lados. So his knife is a stat track flip knife emerald, and it's just ridiculous how rare that is. I mean, a emerald knife is 10 times rarer than all the other gamma doppler phases, and then the stat track makes it 10 times rarer than a normal knife, so stat track knives are 10 times rarer than a normal knife, so that just shows you how rare something like this is. Unfortunately, it's not on like a Karambit or an M9, but it's still a flip knife. 
a emerald stat track for Arcanum. I believe it's a decent float as well, and it does just look absolutely beautiful in game. So uh, this is definitely one of the best unboxings, or I think it is the best unboxing from the Gamma cases so far that's been caught on video. There's been some other nice knives unboxed that I went over in my other video, but unfortunately those weren't covered on video. But hope you guys enjoyed this top five unboxings video. If you want to watch my video on the top five most expensive knife unboxings or the five rarest knife unboxings, you can check that, those videos out. Links on screen. And if you search a little harder on my channel, you can also find a video on the top five, five most expensive gun unboxings. So if you like these videos, feel free to check those out as well. But I'm McSkillet, and I'm out.